AJ Squad. Welcome back to the of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we got this cool underground here and basically what this is, is a glass screen protector that is used for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. But I believe for this one, they also have this available for the iPhone 14 Pro as well and maybe even for the iPhone 14. But like I mentioned for this one in particular, it is for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. And then see for the one that we got right here from this brand. So first, I'm going to open this up to show you guys what's included inside. So once you guys open up, here is basically what the inside looks like. Let's take it all out. So first thing inside right here, if you guys do open up, pretty much inside they do probably got two of these glass screen protectors and both of them are the same. So I'm going to take out one of them to show you guys what it looks like. All right, so once you guys take it out, here is basically what the product looks like. So you can see the glass that's on here definitely looks and feels like a high quality material. And right here they do probably got some specs and features on here. So they mentioned how it does have high hardness, anti-fingerprint, easy to install, and they mentioned how it's 10 times stronger. And the cool thing about this product is the fact that not only is it stronger, but also give you guys a really clear design. So that way when you guys do put it on, it does not affect like a view when you guys do use it. But here is basically what the glass screen protector looks like. Let me show you guys what else is included in the package. So next up right here, they do probably guys a user manual to teach you guys how to set it up. And right here, they do probably guys two of these packages with everything that's included inside, in terms of wet wipe, dry wipes, and the stickers as well. But the last thing inside, even see they do probably guys two more stuff. So let's take it out. So right here, they do probably got the accessory for you guys to install the glass screen protector. So that way you guys won't have any issue when you guys do install it. And then right here, they do probably got a scraper option that you can use to apply on real easy to push it down when you guys do install it. And that is basically everything that's included in the package. Now I'm gonna put this down on the table to show you guys how to install it. And then we'll come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so right here, I do have a phone. First thing I wanna do is take everything out. Once you guys take everything out, first thing I wanna do is to use a wet wipe to wipe it down. Once you guys finish wiping it, you guys use a dry wipe right here to wipe it. Make sure it's clean and there's no dust on here. Once you guys finish using dry wipe to wipe it down, if you guys don't see any dust on here, feel free to use the tape right here to move it. All right, so that should be good. Now let's put this on and then we'll stick it on. All right, so once you guys put this on, now you can peel this out and stick it on. All right, so I'll peel it out. Once you guys peel it out, you can apply it on and do it fast. All right, so just like that. And just let it do its own thing. If there's anywhere that cannot finish itself, you can basically use this tool to kind of glide it. All right, so once you guys put it on, this is basically what the screen looks like when you guys do activate it. So you see how it does have that always on display on here. So even when you guys do turn it off, but if you guys do open it, here is basically what the screen looks like when you guys do activate it. And you see how everything is super clear. And when you guys do use it, nothing is affected. Everything is actually very smooth when you guys do use it, which is pretty cool. So regardless, if you guys do leave fingerprint on here, that won't be an issue. And if you guys do scratch it, that won't be an issue as well. But here is basically what the pot looks like once you guys do set it up. And you see it definitely looks pretty nice and it does work. Welcome right, back guys. So now it's a quick test of pot and definitely actually does work and it works quite well. If you see the whole installation process and everything didn't take that long, it's actually very easy and very simple. If you guys follow all the instructions in terms of using the different accessories, the wet wipe, the dry wipe, the sticker, etc., you shouldn't have any issues and there shouldn't be any bubbles when you guys do install it. And if you guys seen my previous video, you guys seen that I reviewed a bunch of these uh, glass screen protectors from this brand and I never had any issue with them because the material that they use on here is a high quality glass, but that is basically everything that's on the product. Now to come boxing and testing the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not that's worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality glass screen protector that you can use for your iPhone 14 Pro Max to give you guys the extra protection layer for your screen, then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. <coughs> but then obviously for those you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.